Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Airships. We are going to start spying. Ooh, that guy actually lost his main ship fleet thing. Let's see. Ooh, suspendium cannons. That's pretty fancy. Uh-oh, he's on, our, on his way to us. We better get a building built just to have a building built. I want to do a black tower, but spies can take over, can take out these things so easily, it would be a waste of money. So we're going to go with the redoubt and put it on this hill here. And hopefully that will be done by the time we are invaded. Well, at least we got another expendable ship over here first. So let's see what the hell is this thing? <clears throat> uh, hi there. <laughs> you have a big ship. And it does not look like it's going to be easy to take it out. <laughs> oh boy. I would love to see the inner workings of this ship. Because it looks pretty awesome. I th think this is a ship that I built myself, actually. Maybe. Because it looks like it has the design of being completely stupidly powerful. And I tend to do that. But I don't know. So, to go and... First thing I'm going to do, move the creosote down. Move this guy to the back and flip him around. And move this guy to the here. Alright, he's moved out of range of this guy. That's okay. We will slip back to here. The creosote can focus on coming up from beneath. How he took out your banner. And this guy better move him over here. This is going to be the most micromanaged battle I have done in this game. Oh, he's lost capability of moving left and right. That's unfortunate. Well, um, I unfortunately can no longer issue commands, but we have managed to take his ship down so it cannot fly. And we've set him on fire. So, <laughs> victory? I don't know what to consider this. But I think one of us is going to end up surrendering. And it's probably going to be me. Yep. Fortunately, he has nothing to prevent an invasion. And we really need to get some more ships built. The Expendables are great ships. Very easy to replenish them. Cheap, especially since now we have cheaper wood, so we save $20 each. We conquered this one, no problem. Let's just gently take it over. Uh-oh, got another one incoming. Looks like it's heading for Nedekar. Let's get a defense built. Build a building. We'll go with a rap rampart this time. If 
that's not going to be finished. Oh, shoot. And he's not going to arrive in time for reinforcing. This guy is really putting out a lot of big, expensive ships. Fortunately, only one seems to have guns that can shoot upwards. And if I were to take that one down, it'd make defending a lot easier. Why don't you flip? Flip around! Seriously, flip around! God darn it! Okay, so it's not going to flip. I guess I will come in underneath and let them focus on this ship. This is probably a bad idea because if this ship falls down, it's going to squish me between that and the other ship. Not that I have very many... very much in the way of uh, guns, but... Yeah. Okay, so I lost Netakar. The citizens have revolted. I am losing things horribly to this guy. Oh my god! Okay, so, um, we're going to lose this city as well. Which is great. I guess I shouldn't have relied on expendable ships to do everything for me. Look, he's using an expendable ship. But you know what? I'm certain that I will be able to beat him. In fact, let's just move a little bit closer to make sure that it's point-blank rapid-firing. Oh, we're gone. Suspendium chambers offline. Hey, he fell farther than I did. I win! <laughs> uh, let's move you guys back. Sheesh, everyone's going after me now. Hawick has been conquered! This guy is annoying as hell. Alright, go. Victory is mine. Seriously, I think I have lost this game because I can't do anything to prevent him from conquering my cities without having to even invade them. How do you even incite people to rebel? Ha! I can hit you with grenades! That was simple. God darn it! <laughs> I lose! I can't do anything! All of my cities have been conquered 
through either an overwhelming force by this guy. Kudos to him. He did a great job. Or by... Yeah, it, it takes a lot to incite a revolt, and it looks like it's very unlikely to actually succeed. But he succeeded multiple times. He probably just kept on spamming it. I think this game needs a little bit of counter-spy measures, because spies clearly are overpowered. Nope. Screw you. My city. Eh, he's one. See, look, he even gets all of the ships that are in the city when he conquers it. That is ridiculous. I mean, thankfully, these are just bombers, so it might be easier for me to not die. Except for the fact that my ship took forever to actually start moving, so I got some free hits on me. Target the bomber ship. I've lost. We know it's true. I'm a loser. <laughs> uh, this game turns around really fast if you are not staying on top of attacking constantly. Well, let's see what goes. How long how long this lasts until I'm dead. Can't give it commands anymore. Ammo is low. Repairs are greatly needed. I think that means water is gone. Is that what that means? Yep, out of water. I'm surprised that it was still alive for that long. Well, <laughs> I have already lost. <laughs> oh my god, this guy is overpowered. His ships, man. They were just incredibly built. Clearly, I should have focused less on making a small expendable fleet that I could swarm a ship and just building one big ship that can sit there and take everything. Well, I guess that's it for my first foray into this. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and favorite, and I will see you next time, wherever that may be. Take care, and bye-bye.